What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video and today's video I'm showing you guys my green screen setup. Now most people think you know you just put the green screen down or up or whatever and it automatically works just like that. But that's not the case when it comes to green screens. There's actually a lot more that goes into it other than the editing. The lighting has to be perfect and if you guys don't know what I mean, you have to have this uh, like a certain kind of lighting in order to, for the green screen the green screen to work so you can't just you know plop it up and then bam it just works like that so i want to show you guys how i get my green screen to work and if you guys haven't seen my green screen to work uh go ahead and check out my other videos there's a ton of them um and it's actually probably going to be coming out pretty soon maybe even today it's 2 a.m so i'll probably have some out by uh, i don't know 5 7 p.m um We'll see. I might be sleeping because it's 2 a.m. and I stay up. So let's go ahead and show you guys around. Um, first, I'm going to show you guys my my uh, my whole entire room, just to kind of give you guys an idea of what I'm working with when it comes to green screen. So I have a light there, some arcade machines, a gaming setup. There's a green screen. Uh, there's a slideshow TV with all the arcade games possible you can play. Got a projector. You know some. Game over, fountain, Alexa, motherboard. Uh, this is actually a screen from one of the Pac-Man. So, screen, you know, I ordered an extra one. There's some two joysticks. I got some more in here. Uh, but let me know if you guys can see the obvious of uh, this green screen. Let, let me know if you guys. That's, let me rephrase that. Let me see if you guys. Uh, let me know if you guys see the obvious and how this green screen works. I'll give you guys a little tour. Um, are all around the room just to kind of give you guys an idea and let me know let me know what you guys uh, think is obvious on how the green screen works there's actually a couple things that makes the green screen work so I'll go ahead and get you guys started so the obvious thing is the lighting um, if you guys don't know I have a light behind this bed a light up here that connects all the way around the room and I have a light behind my desk in my computer right here and right there and there now most people think I chose green because I love green yes that is the case I do love green but not only that it's the most important light in the room that makes the green screen work if I were to put that light to red blue or any other color than green the green screen would not work that's why I mean and that's what I mean when green screen is the most important thing or uh, lighting is the most important thing when it comes to green screens um, I'll show you guys what else so most people think you know I use that light no if I were to use this light it'd be too bright on my face not only that it would create a reflection off the green screen and it would just would not work the second most obvious thing is the lights up here you guys can see that these change a color um, with different multiple colors it changes uh, from multiple colors all the time um, especially that one. This one's kind of a Christmas light almost. Um, so what I do is I change that from to white. I change that to white. This changes to white as well. I change that light to white and I change my computer to white. What this does is it creates a nice beautiful lighting um, effect in my room so that not only is it you know clear on my face but it makes it brighten up the mood and it makes it look very nice. Um, the next most important thing is the camera placement to how the green screen works. Pretty soon I'll show you guys uh, what the green screen looks like when I pull it down. But the camera is also the most important thing. You guys might think, hey, I like that position. No. If I could choose a different position, I definitely would. Unfortunately, I do not have many places I could put it where the green screen would work. That is just you know one of the options i have the reason because if i were to put it anywhere else it would see these colors down here maybe any other part of my room that would just completely ruin it so the reason i have it right there is because when i pull the green screen down it creates a perfect image or it captures the perfect image of the green screen and all I have to do is, uh, is some cropping out in OBS and that is basically it. Once it's done, I, I fit perfectly. The next thing that is most important in this room is the light right there. That light right there is probably one of the most important. Because it's green, I do like that it's green. 
because uh, you know aliens are sometimes green blah 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 uh, if it's green or if it's any other type of color the green skin will not work and it'll actually you know make it look like crap so putting green on that uh, you know alien kind of helps with the color and it brightens up my face and makes it look really good not only that I probably could put that camera right there because it is, you know, attachable, but then I would have a long cord just reaching across over there and it just look horrible. I do have a really, really good camera in here that I use for some videos and it also can connect. If you guys can see that uh, screwy thing right there, it can also connect to that light over there and I can, you know, use it. But uh, I also have a tripod I'm using right now that I can go ahead and set right there and that'll also work. So, you know, that's just something to think about if I ever wanted to have some good um, image. But, like I said, the most important thing in this room is this light right there. I, if I could, would change it to any other color, but unfortunately, to make the green screen work, it's got to be that color. And uh, the colors on it do not save, so... That is just something to think about. I, I would change if I could, if it saved, but unfortunately, it does not save. So, here we have the green screen. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it looks like from the other side. This is basically what it just looks like. It just drops down, um, but this is what it looks like. So, I'm gonna go over here for a better view of it. It just drops down and then I set like that. So, like I said, Hold on, my mic is getting caught in my glasses. Uh, so like I said, you know, that light just basically reflects off the wall onto the green screen, making it perfect for, you know, the camera to capture the green screen, and it works good, it works fine. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it looks like on the other side as well, if I can fit through here without messing anything up. Okay. This is basically what it looks like when you walk in my room. It's just a massive green screen and it kind of blocks my desk so you can't you can't really see my desk. Um, and that's basically it. So let's go ahead and look at it when it goes up. Usually I would just let it go, you know, but uh, I have people sleeping and not only that, uh, it's barely into the ceiling by studs. Uh, so if I do let it go like that, then eh, who knows what will happen. But that's basically how the green screen works. You just have to have good lighting. Um, you kind of have to fidget with it. So if you guys' green screen is not working well and it's having some problems, uh, you just kind of get the lighting well. Most people will use too much lighting. Most people won't have enough lighting. Most people will use, uh, you know, red lighting or green or not green, blue lighting, you know, yellow lighting, different color lighting so that will mess up your green screen. So the thing that the, the thing that I can tell you is make your lights, if you have these, make them white and get a, a green light bulb. So get a green light bulb and place it somewhere away from your green screen with just enough to where your green screen can kind of see it. Uh, but that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.